With 10 beekeepers in discussion, there will be 20 answers. I work with the 21st answer. I dare to be different. I call this the tech method. G'day beaks and beaks to be. Are you curious about learning more about beekeeping? When I met Alan through my local beekeeping club, I knew nothing about bees. A lot of people think they do, all they do is cut it out. And you can talk into it, you know, yep. Yeah, yeah. So here we have a, uh, this was a drone layer and we found it's been overtaken by a small hive beetle. So therefore you could see these large and small hive beetle chewing through all of your gear. And these are the ones that haven't been washed off and as you can see how they can proliferate in the cells. So the way you can save your hive, and look at the number of them. No. The way you can save your frames is to um, simply hose out the cells as we're doing here and then you shake the water out and it not only removes these grubs and um, <clears throat> washes out all the slime but then you can replace it back into a healthy hive um, and they'll be cleaned up quickly and you can it saves you cutting out all these frames and destroying all your work so as you can see in the water all these grubs are getting washed out subscribe to learn more. Some yeah, unreal, look at that. The water there. Please like, subscribe and comment. So that shows you what, um, you know, the, the numbers. And this, this was caught early. So if it had been left to go to a, to a dead out, you'd have a lot bigger troubles than this. So early detection is key. Right, just follow me around. Yep. Right. And, yep. So don't be shy when you shake that water out. Because out with it will come all those grubs who will be eaten alive by ants pretty quickly. And as you can see, even as, as Alan's tapping them there, they're, they're flicking out like, nothing's, like nothing else. Get all that water out. And we've done this time and time again with just a frame or two as necessary, mostly with stickies. And um, placed into a healthy hive. Uh, they'll be cleaned up pretty quickly. Do not place them into a hive if they're still full of grub, um, or still full of that slime, and haven't been left to air like or this. A weak hive. Or do, yeah, especially not into a weak hive. Um, because all you do is introducing trouble into something that's already having worries. So it'd be a strong honey hive, is what you're after. It's the discoloration of the water, eh? Yep. Please like, subscribe, and click the bell to my channels. Thanks for watching all Aussie content.